I'm Sean Delaney with Delaney Antique Clocks and today we're featuring a New Bedford, Massachusetts tall case clock made by Stephen Tabor, circa 1811. Stephen Tabor was a very famous maker. He had a brother, L. Nathan Tabor, that was nine years his senior, that apprenticed in Roxbury with Simon Willard, the country's most famous maker. And Stephen Tabor apprenticed with Simon's younger brother, Aaron Willard. Not only was Stephen a famous clockmaker, but he also invested heavily in the railroads and the whaling industry, whaling ships, and really amassed a, a large fortune. He died in 1862, and his wife took a lot of that wealth and founded the Tabor School in Marion, Massachusetts, which is still in operation today. This case is mahogany. It stands 8 feet 11 inches tall. There's a beautiful cross-banded base with nice figure in the base. Stands on a uh, flared French foot. Nice long rectangular figured mahogany door and a Pearson open fretwork with three chimney fluted chimney plinths and brass ball and spike finials. Without doubt, this dial is one of the nicest dials I've seen in a long time. Colorfully painted, the condition is fabulous. Has a lunar calendar in the arch. The signature is a 10, signed Stephen Tabor. Beautiful, fully turned and fluted columns in the bonnet. This is a beautiful Stephen Tabor tall case clock. New Bedford, Massachusetts, circa 1811. If you like beautiful antique clocks, please visit DelaneyAntiqueClocks.com. Thank you for watching.